guys, welcome back to Vlogmas Day 17, or well, well, welcome to Vlogmas Day 17, should I say. Today I'm going to be doing like, a get, re get ready with me, slash reacting, slash answering your opinion, slash assumptions on me. Obviously everyone has their assumptions, some good, some bad, well, some nice, some not nice. I thought I'd do it. It's been a couple of hours since I first actually recorded this because I finished it at like quarter to at the latest. It was about quarter to twelve. Well, my second half clip was quarter to twelve. But yeah. But just I should stop rambling on and let's just get into the video. Okay, so just prior to this, I put on my primer and I used the MUA Skin Define Hydro Primer. Again, I know it's not sold. I'm sorry. I do try and use up all the stuff I get. Well, all the stuff I buy, should I say. I'm going to be using the Rumble London Lasting Finish 25 Hour Foundation. Full coverage in 100 Ivory. And... Let's pump some of this onto my hand. Once I've sort of started blending my foundation, I will get into the opinions. Or assumptions, should I say. And also, if you don't follow my Instagram, which is only Caitlin YT, but I will leave it linked down below. Or at least the name's down below. I'll try and link it this time, but I also might forget, so I'm sorry if I forget. The fact that the uh, foundation has gone under my uh, nail. Not the most, no, not the nicest. There we go. Whilst it loads up, oh, there we go. First one is people have told me from your old school, actually, no. But starting, it says, someone assumed that I smell. The answer is no, I don't. And I did actually reply to that. And I asked, what makes you think that? And she replied back with, people from tell me from, people have told me from your old school that you smell. Well, that opinion's about a year and a half old. I used to have a problem where I didn't smell the nicest, but I don't have that problem. So why don't I just grab my small mirror? Oh, do I even know where my small mirror is? Probably not. That's annoying. But basically, I used to have a slight problem where I wouldn't smell the nicest. And also where my hair didn't look the nicest either. Have I got a mirror in any of my photos? No, they have not. Is there a mirror in this? I can't remember. Yes, there is a mirror in this. The fact that I usually um do my eyebrows first is quite weird because I'm doing my foundation. But, oh well. But, yeah, that's, that opinion's old, is, what, is all I'm going to say to that. And also, don't believe everything you're told. So. So just take everything with a pinch of salt, really. 
because yes there are people in the spot that don't smell the nicest but it's like why go publicizing it to people i don't know and also how my opinion is old so Foundation, done. Now let's move on to the MUA Hide and Conceal Concealer in the shade Fair, which I believe was the lighter shade available to me. Yeah, I believe so. Actually, am I going to apply this to your brows? Let's just move on to the next assumption. And of course, this would turn off. Someone, go, someone assumed that I'm super healthy. The answer to that is no. What you don't realise is, John Lair, I have a tub of popcorn. A large tub, 250 grams, over a decent half of it. And one portion is 50 grams. Mm, so, you know, I'm not healthy. I just don't post about all the junk food I've eaten on my Instagram or anything. Because it's just, it's like, nobody wants to see that you've eaten half a tub of popcorn on your own. Like, yeah. Also, it was a sweet popcorn as well. Comment down below what you, actually no. I'm going to leave a poll in the, in this corner asking what, what your favourite out of toffee, sweet or salted, what your favourite is. I might just leave another, but just an option saying other, just in case. That's not your favourite, but I'm going to leave a poll up there. So I can see what your favourite popcorn is. Next I'm going to be using, actually no, I need to do brows. Actually no, I will do this next. I'm going to be using the MUA Progress Matte Satin Pressed Powder and let's just say this, I might have lost quite a lot of this to the floor but luckily I managed to hear it up before it went before it actually pressed into the carpet but I currently have my towel, my throat and this cushion next to me to cover the ground And so I definitely will need a new one. I'm kind of trying to both stipple it but also like apply it in circular motions. Because for anyone who is new to my channel, and if you are, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and join this little family. 
but I have quite oily skin so I need to mattify it down and yes I know I did a get ready with me a couple of days ago well it was day 11 that the get ready with me was uploaded but it's like At this point I'm just kind of going off track of my original plan. Like I have got some other ones I've got planned, I will do, because I've already set out the plan for them and all that, but yeah. And I was thoroughly making sure that was done. Now let's move on to brows and for that I'm going to be using the Revolution Pro Brow Pomade in the shade Auburn. Anyone who's already subscribed is probably bored of me saying all these products because I've used them so so often. There we go. Here's the stuff I'm doing my brow. Also, fun fact, I'm going to be observing a mock trial. It's a fake mock trial, I will point out. But I'm going to be observing a mock, a mock trial. And I'm not going to say what happens in that mock trial, just in case there's like younger people watching because I don't want to frighten them are my eyebrows done? I need to fill in that little bit up there but other than that yeah they are Like to point out, nobody in my college has seen me with go to college with makeup on, and I'm not kidding either because I don't have time in the morning to do my makeup. Yet two of them turn up with a full face. Like what the hell? Uh, mm, good on them. Good on them. Let's close that up. Okay, now, next assumption is that I have a lot of makeup. No, I don't. I've been using pretty much the same products in all of my makeup videos and it does get boring. I will point out. But I'm hopefully getting more eyeshadow palettes, so more looks, different palettes, a different range, and so videos will be mixed up, a bit more exciting. So that's a good thing. I'm... Which brush do I want to grab? I'm going to grab this brush. And yes, I did originally have green them. I'm probably going to spend tonight cleaning my makeup brushes. Because I've got time. And I'm firstly just... 
Actually, no, I need to apply eye primer. Oh yeah, I don't have a ton of makeup. Because it's like... I can't afford it and I've not been buying any makeup recently to like review because I know I'll be getting some at Christmas so I'm waiting to see what I get at Christmas first I'm just using the elf eye primer I've used it in a video before so it's nothing exciting it's nothing new What I do know is that my mum's had two packages from Morphe. Two packages. I'm just gonna grab this sort of matte shade right here and I'm just gonna use it to, which doesn't really show up much, but I'm just gonna use it to sort of go over the eye primer so I've got a base. And so that it just, the pigment doesn't just stick to it But yeah, just know I don't have a lot of makeup. I did also ask for assumptions on a different account. I'm not going to promote that account because it's for a different channel that I haven't uploaded in. In ages. I haven't uploaded on in ages. Which I should do. But, yeah. Now I've set that base, I can, and also I can use the same brush. I'm gonna grab into this sort of goldy brown shade. Very pretty, like it's a shimmer, but I'm gonna put it in my crease. Let's see, tap effect first. Someone from my college assumed that I don't like them. Well, I do. Also, her name's Carly. I do like her. Just. I don't know. Some things about her that annoy me is all I'm going to say. It's just we've not got the same energy. She's like more outgoing and yeah, she's just more outgoing. So it's like we've just got different energies. And so we clash, or at least me and her best friend do. Needs a bit more on the side. I'm now going to grab the 17 single eyeshadow and which looks like 
this. It's still a shimmer, but it's slightly darker than the previous shade. And grabbing another brush, which again, I need to wash my brushes. I'm trying to flick off any excess product from last time I used it. I'm just going to grab some of this and I'm going to use it to deepen up my crease. got a new subscriber because I got the notification saying I got a new subscriber that makes me so happy it honestly does as well And I think I've just, I've just forgotten to uh, top off the excess that last time, but oh well. Let's answer the next assumption. Molly assumed that I know everything. And the answer to that is no, I don't know everything. I just have an answer for everything. I don't mean to, I just do. And I do it without thinking. And I'm sorry if it annoys people because again, it's something I do, it's a habit. And so I'm sorry to anyone it offends. Yeah, why have I closed that? Because I still need it. But finish with that eye, shall I? Also, all my brushes fell out whilst I was moving it, so that's great. Actually, no, I'm gonna grab I'm gonna use my finger for this. I'm gonna tap into this gold shade that's in the palette very very pretty and I'm gonna actually no I've not finished deepening up my crease Jesus Christ woman oh and I'm going to go into this matte brown oh geez that's deep and I'm gonna further deepen up this outer edge. That was the worst finger I could have tried to wipe it away from. Then using my little finger and grabbing this literally white shade. Possibly. I'm playing as life. I wonder if it's going to an RAF base. That looks like a bloody normal plane, though. Probably just going into an RAF base. I have got more assumptions on Snapchat and so I'm going to have to end this and quickly pop back after taking a picture of 
the other assumptions. So I've managed to get them onto my tablet and I'm going to grab into that gold jade like I said I was before. I ended up deepening up my crease even more and using my finger I'm just going to apply this to my lid. In case you're wondering why that I've changed clip, it's because my mum came back upstairs and I was going to rage to come in my room because she has a habit of just doing that. So, yeah. Let's get back on the assumptions and answer the last two. The next one is going to be from a subscriber. But first, let's let's do mascara first actually let's grab the pencil eyeliner the next is basically it says before we spoke off of youtube it's super hard to read your personality from your videos but you're so nice which is obviously It's obviously very super to say that I'm super nice. Um, obviously that's not an assumption, but it's like. Something I didn't realise. I didn't know whether it was super hard to read my personality. I'd like to point out, I'm not actually getting for a dramatic eye, and yeah, I just didn't know it was super hard for you guys to read my personality. And I'm sorry it's super hard to read my personality, but I don't know what I can do to sort of change that. Anyone who's watched most of my videos will know I cannot do frigging eyeliner to save my life, but let's try and apply some to my waterline. And then we're gonna need to put that there.
I would find out it looks dramatic. I'm going to try and soften this out a bit. Not that brush. By grabbing a different brush and grabbing that medium shade, that medium like silver we used, or at least I used, and I'm trying to smoke it into the eyeliner. Why do I keep closing that? Uh. Oh yeah, I don't, like, I don't realise it's super hard to read my personality. Because it's like, yeah. And I'm sorry about that. But let's just move on to the next. Next one was asked by Alan. And his is both an opinion. Yeah, it's also kind of sweet in a way and it says you are argumentative yet you get to the point and it's then he's put self-confident so I guess he thinks I'm quite self-confident and I do have my days when I'm self-confident But then I also have my days when I'm not as confident, which is normal. It's a part of life and to everybody watching, no matter what your age, Just love yourself. And yeah, I am argumentative. But that's because people annoy me and I can get a little bit frustrated easily. And I did tend to snap easy, quite. I keep closing this thing. And I did tend to snap quite easy. And um, that was just, yeah. I just ended up snapping quite easily. Next, let's move on to bronzer. And in secondary, I guess I did have that sort of friendship group to sort of be like, no, don't say anything, don't let him bother you, that sort of thing. Whereas here, I don't have that. So it's like. No one's really there to keep my behaviour in check and to tell me just don't bother with him. But quite, but there are times when those arguments happen in lesson and they're to do with the content.
Not all the time though, so. But, especially with things that I said at college, I like to make my opinion vocal. So. And obviously that can be perceived as a bad thing. I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I'm argumentative. That uh, I have an opinion. Would you rather I just shut up, not say anything, and be really, really quiet? Don't answer that question. Because I know that people from college would answer yes to that question. But I'm not going to comply to what people want me to do. That's just not me. Because honestly, I don't give a fuck what people think sometimes. Oh, actually, that's just made me think of something else. A comment on my last video. Not last video. It wouldn't have been my last video. But comment, a comment on one of my recent videos has said, has said, like, they call me a jive turkey. That's not the thing that bothered me. But also I don't look like a jive turkey, so screw you. And their channel name was Only Caitlin as a whore. Firstly, they had a space in between Only Caitlin. There wasn't an, there wasn't a space. Plus, they missed out the L and it's a K in the in my name, Caitlin. Plus, a whore is a prostitute. And in order to be a prostitute, you'd have had to have sex with multiple men to be charging them. Yeah, I'm a virgin. So, there's no logic in that one. So. I'm not a whore. And. Yeah. And that's that. Just thought I'd uh, kind of mention that, seems I thought it. Seems I would, it kind of came to thought. And I don't appreciate being called a whore. I don't, basic, well, I was basically called a whore. And I don't like it. And I did comment back. Saying that A, I don't look like a jive turkey, and also correcting them grammatically. I'm spelling. Okay. There's, um. They kind of need it. Not had the best education, have they? Not been raised right. Next, let's move on to highlight, because this girl needs to go. And I'm going to be using the Revolution Pro 4K highlighter. Just look a little bit on the messy because there is a lot of kick there is quite a bit of kickback. I will point that out. But I'm just gonna be grabbing this gold shade right here. There we go. And tapping off the millions before that. applying this to my cheekbones I'm also now having all the fallout on my legs so that's great
and now I'm all covered in glitter because it is basically the glitter chunks that come out. What else have I got to do? Then highlight. Lips. Okay, now recently my lips have been seriously dry. I know I don't know why because I have been staying hydrated. And so to make sure I'm not and so I'm not going to be using a matte lipstick for this. I'm going to be using the e.l.f. High Shine Liquid Lipstick in the shade Naked Nude. Also I'm checking what time it is. I should also check on here as well. There we go, quarter past eleven. On the fourteenth. Have I done day fourteen? Yes. Yes I have. I have recorded day fourteen. Just wanted to make sure of that one. And obviously as you're growing up, you're taught, you're taught, think about what you're going to say before you say it. I kind of don't stick to that in real life, but I do stick to it online. Are they getting a lot of planes or something? I do stick to it online because it is something to follow. And I'm now going to go and do my hair quickly off of camera and I will see you shortly. Don't know what I was doing with my arms there, but yeah. Okay, so I've completed everything. I've done my hair. I've only done it lightly. I've also, oh God, the sun. And my eye is watering. I've also repainted my nails and yeah. Okay, so I'm now back. This is obviously the completed look obviously the opinions of me yeah and some of them i'm definitely i'm not a fan of but people have their opinions and yeah i also forgot to put on satin spray i did realize that as i was walking but the eyeshadow has stayed that could also be because i put eye primer on yeah, you definitely can see the A46 from here. I think. Yeah. Oh. Never realised that. <laughs> but, anywho, that is the end of this video. If you guys enjoyed and did stay to the end, then I will put an emoji on the screen up here that I want you to comment in the comments so I know you stuck around to the end because I know I can take a while for videos but and if you did like these videos don't forget to smash a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe pretty please so you know see so and also turn on the post notifications so you know when I next upload any comments and also if you any ever need any support then my email is always in the description box or if you ever have any crazy video ideas that you don't want to comment because you think they're too crazy then just email them me as well and I will happily respond to whether I will do it, whether I find it crazy, that sort of thing and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!